First thing we're gonna do is come in here to nothing loaded. We're gonna bring up flywheel. We'll load this, set RPM, and motor on. Now, Jim, if you'll rotate that over to TDC. All right. Basically, an 875 drill, drill 170 thousandths, and the job is done. Completed our drilling, so we'll just go up and turn the motor on. Let it come back up to speed. Once we're back at 500, we'll start drawing in the data. Our goal here is to be better than two tenths ounce inch. You're seeing right here. In this particular case, we're sitting at 0.04 ounce inch or 0.2 grams. This unit is balanced. In some cases, what we have, where we have drill corrections, you're going to take note that it's calling for a drill located near, in this case, a mounting hole. Well, obviously, you don't want to compromise the flywheel, so what we're going to do is we're going to show a drill split. We're going to go to the right and to the left of it, but we're going to let the computer tell us where to go. All right, we now have a flywheel that has some excess amount of imbalance in it, and what we're going to do is just go ahead and sample the flywheel. Again, we're going to spin up here to about 500 RPM. Once we've drawn in the 500 RPM, you'll see it start to analyze again. And in this particular case, you'll see that we have 84.81 grams. Now that's quite a bit of weight, but it's also telling me that multiple drills are required. So we can't do this with one drill, so I'm just gonna touch, it's gonna give me a working screen here that we can come up with a few solutions. It's already given us one. One is saying the 875 drill can be split in two positions. And so we can see that these units would be at 5 degrees on the right and 355 on the left. Now, if we have an obstruction or there's a bolt hole or for whatever reason we can't work in that area, we can go in there and say, look, let's go ahead and move over. Now it's saying, do you want to hold present depth setting? Just say no for a minute. And what it's done is it's moved the drill over and assigned it. In fact, it's sitting at 18 degrees and it's got 9.85 grams to go. But over here, notice the screen yellow. Now what that's telling you is that if you do this, it's going to spin up the next time and be heavy right there. That's not the goal. The goal now is to move the drill over. Now you notice we went to the other side. Now I can adjust that by playing a little Pac-Man game with it here until I move the needle to correct position. And so I'm at 21 degrees on the right, 339 degrees on the left. We'll have 0.01 left. So again, 875 drill, depth 0.167, to the right at exactly 21 degrees and to the left at 339 and the job is done.